So cyberpunk has been out a few days now and while well, it's had its ups and downs, today we discuss such and talk about the facts reports are flowing in stating Sony have started refunding people for the game. How's it going guys my name's DPJ and if you enjoyed this video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more cyberpunk be sure to subscribe. So what I'm about to say will probably piss a few people off, I don't mean to but it just probably will. I have been super lucky in terms of game breaking bugs, I haven't really experienced any besides the game's auto saving feature overwriting my second character which I didn't manually save so me I lost 6 hours progression but we won't talk about that. But other than that guys I honestly haven't had or even seen any crazy bugs that really altered the game I'm playing. I personally do however know a couple of people who have had a few crashes here and there but for the most part it in my opinion doesn't seem as bad as a lot of people are making out. Hold up hold up hold up people let me finish. The game is buggy yes we cannot deny that. Was it ready to be released? I'd say no we can't deny that either. But is it terribly buggy like their latest fallout was? I ain't too sure and this is what people are comparing it to. The only bugs I'm actually seeing are funny ones which put a smile on my face like Rogue dancing at the end of this mission this had me crying people. Now I will state, the most recent patch or hotfix, the 1.04 hotfix, they dropped. It dropped yesterday on Xbox and it dropped the day before on PC and PlayStation. It was around 15 gigabytes or so. But the difference it's made is incredible. I am noticing much better stability and overall a better gaming experience. But for me it wasn't that bad before this patch. Now because I play on the Xbox Series X, I obviously haven't experienced the game on PC, PS5, PS4, the Xbox One and the Xbox One X. So I can't really put out an opinion on said platforms. Now if I'm honest, I actually can't see the game performing well on older PS4 and Xbox One consoles. I mean, I just can't see it happening. And if I'm honest, I wouldn't expect it to either. This game is clearly made for next gen and the game was clearly released too early but it's still far beyond anything I've played for many many years and this is just my opinion. I've read that of many others and I respect what people have to say. Some people hate the game, for others it's so buggy they can't play it. I've even seen one person state it keeps crashing their console. The worrying thing about this report was it was on an Xbox Series X. Now yesterday on Twitter, Cyberbug was trending which was hilarious seeing some of the tweets. Some of the bugs we were seeing are pretty amazing, like genitalia popping through those clothes and shit like that. And today guys we are seeing reports flying out all over the internet. From legit sources I will state that Sony have started refunding people who purchased this game. Now although the game is fine for me, if it wasn't, I'd expect a refund. I actually brought the latest Fallout, I mean it was ages back now but it was the latest Fallout, can't remember what it's called, the game was that bad. And I was stuck in some crazy bug cycle and you know what, Xbox would not refund me the bastards. But it's good seeing Sony doing the right thing because let's face it, if the game doesn't work as intended then in my opinion people are entitled to refunds. And all this negativity we are seeing, the complaints, the cyberbug trending tweets, Sony refunding folk. I still think it will get worse for CDPR before it gets better. This game was released too early, I think we all can agree on that, even if we love this game I think we can all agree it was released too early. I don't think even an early next year release would have sorted the problems they are having. I mean think about it people, day one patches won't fix the game, they've been working on this game for years, if they can't get it perfect in years, a patch they've been working on in a month won't fix it. In my opinion this game won't even be close to perfect until maybe June, July next year, maybe even later. But you know what, I'm having such a good time with it, I will play it, ride out the bugs and enjoy myself while that background maintenance is being applied. I just wish the experience I was having with this game was the same for others, but unfortunately that's definitely not the case. People tell me your honest thoughts on this game, have you had any serious bugs? Not ones where people are disappearing, not ones where NPCs are stuck dancing, I'm talking about game breaking bugs, bugs where you're stuck in cycles and you can't progress, things like that. Also tell me what you think about this game, has it lived up to the hype you had for it? Let me know. And on that note guys the end of the video has arrived, 
If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you are new around here and want to see more cyberpunk and stay up to date with all the latest cyberpunk news, guides, glitches, absolutely everything, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.